Hi, good morning. Obviously, this is not a night night nugget. Have to apologize. Fell asleep last night. Did so much moving around. Just simply fell asleep. Woke up this morning with, uh, oops, forgot the night night nugget. So here we go. Just a quick one. Was sitting outside on the back with my husband, and there was noise. The cars going by, the train going by. There was a dog barking, you know. And just began to think about how sometimes that's the same thing that goes on in our head. We're looking for peace, but there's all these noise in the background, and we just can't figure out. Okay, how can I find peace in my head with everything that's going on. I love Isaiah 26 and 3. It tells us that God will keep us in perfect peace as we keep our mind stayed on Him. And it goes on to say why? Because we trust in Him. When we trust in God, we can begin to attack those thoughts, those nagging thoughts that are attacking us. We can attack it with peace because we trust in God. We know that whatever situation is going on in our life, that God has us, that God is in control, that God is all powerful. He is all knowing and he loves us with an everlasting love. And therefore we can rest in perfect peace. And I love the next verse because it encourages us to trust in the Lord because when we do, we will find strength. There's everlasting strength in God. How many of you have ever been in a situation where you're like, I don't know how I can make it through this, you know? I don't know how I'm gonna be able to take the next breath. But then you rest and rely and you trust in God and you're able to move forward. Not only are we able to move forward, but when we really, really trust in God, I'm not talking about just lip surface, there's that peace that passes understanding. Others around us can't figure out how come he or she can be in such peace with everything that's going on, when really what it is is it's the peacemaker, the peace giver that's within us, and we're trusting in God, and he's keeping us at peace because we can say with assurance, God, I don't know what's going on. I don't understand it. I don't even like it, but you know what I do know? I do know that you are a great God, that you're a loving God, and you have this all in control. And therefore, I may not be able to rest in the situation, but I sure can rest in you. God is amazing. I just want to encourage you today to keep your mind stayed on Him. Your thoughts, whenever the thoughts come that are contrary to His word, cast them down. Think about the amazingness of God. Do like David did. Just go through the Rolodex in your mind and remember all the times that God brought you out. All the times that whenever others didn't think that you would make it or you didn't even think you'd make it. And God came through. Go through. Be at peace today. I just pray for peace for myself and peace for others today. I mean real peace right here and right here in your heart. This is Sabrina with your not night night nugget with your um, morning morning nugget I guess and uh, I will talk to you later. Have a great weekend. Be safe with your 4th of July. Morning.